I'm going to show you today what I got for Addie with the new Be Forever launch. This is the school outfit that she's wearing and this replaces her older school outfit that was in her original collection. I love this. This is absolutely beautiful. This is probably, in my opinion, the nicest outfit that American Girl released with the new line of Be Forever. I think Addie got the best, which I'm really happy for because I love Addie. This school outfit retails for $34 on the AmericanGirl.com website. The jacket is considered a peplum jacket and she has a matching flared skirt. The outfit also comes with two hair ribbons. In the catalog, the current catalog, it says that the hair ribbons are blue, but they're definitely not blue. They're definitely black. And they are attached to a little plastic comb here. And they're pre-tied and they're just a little velveteen black ribbon. So that's what comes with the outfit is the two ribbons, the top, the peplum top, and the skirt. It looks like it's made to look like this shirt underneath is separate, but it's actually all sewn together. It's one piece, but it's nicely done. It doesn't, it doesn't look cheap. And you can see that it's nicely adorned here with ribbon that goes all the way around. They didn't take any shortcuts and stop at the sides, which is awesome. And it closes up the back in Velcro. This opens all the way. The skirt is just elastic at the waist, so you have to pull it over the doll's legs. I have Addie wearing some boots from her original collection. This does not come with the outfit nor do the socks. So what you get for your $34, the peplum top, the skirt, and the hair ribbons. It's absolutely gorgeous. This It, it feels like it's um, probably some type of wool blend. It's a, a medium weight fabric, super high quality. This ribbon here around the waist is a velveteen ribbon. That also, as I mentioned, goes all the way around. It's just a really nice outfit, and it's a beautiful color on her. I absolutely adore this outfit. This is worth, in my opinion, every penny that it costs. Now, I do have underneath her skirt here, she is wearing her chemise and crinoline. That is also a new release for Addie. However, this is just a recycle from the Mari Grace and Cecile collection. It is the exact same pieces, just repackaged for Addie. I knew that for sure. It definitely looked like it, but I knew for sure when I looked at the tag, which says on it that it is copyright 2011. So, obviously they weren't making this for Addie in 2011. This is just Cecile and Mary Grace's chemise and crinoline repackaged. But it's a very nice piece, for, two nice pieces for Addie. What this does for her outfits is really poof out the skirts, which looks amazing and is how the girls wore them during that time. So it adds a little bit of historical accuracy to her outfits and it just looks great. The crinoline and chemise is, retails for $24, and there is a, something in the, it says, can only be worn with Addie's doll set dress, sold on page 25, and Addie's school outfit. So that makes me wonder, this little disclaimer they put in the catalog, whether some of the outfits, like her meat outfit, might be too short, and that the crinoline would show underneath. I suspect that that is probably the case. The chemise, the chemise and crinoline would show. So it may or may not work with all of her dresses and I certainly haven't tried any of the older dresses that I have on her, all of them on with it yet. So I'll let you know if I, if I find out that it just doesn't look good with some of the other dresses. But I suspect that hopefully that any dresses they make in the future for her, any more new releases will 
work with the crinoline and chemise because it really looks nice and adds that nice fullness to her dress and outfit. So the last thing that I got for Addie from the new release, as I kind of just previewed there, is her new me outfit. And this is being sold separately for the moment on AmericanGirl.com for $36. Her me outfit, and it's, it's listed as Addie's outfit. Uh, it, or obviously if you buy a new Addie doll, it will come with. But it comes with this blue dress. It comes with white pantalettes. And it comes with... I think the catalog calls them stockings. They're obviously just little white socks. And it comes with the boots. And the boots are what absolutely sold me on this outfit. I think she looks amazing in the new meet, but the boots were just too cute to not get. So they've got a little heel. I'm not sure if you can see that or not. This is just plastic on the bottom. This is a nice heavyweight canvas. And there is, it's lined with some white fabric as well so that it won't, there's no possibility of it staining your doll's legs, which is great. And then there's these little plastic buttons up the side. The buttons aren't functional, they're just decorative. The shoe does open up in the back with Velcro, as is kind of common with the shoes now. And I didn't have any problem putting this on my doll, even over socks. It, it took a little tugging, it wasn't, it, it didn't just slide on, but it wasn't anything that was too difficult. They're just adorable, and I absolutely love these boots. I think they'll go with a lot of Addie's outfits. If I hadn't used these other shoes that I already had, I think I could have put these shoes on, and they would have matched the outfit really well. I just love them. I think they're so cute. The pantalettes are just a cotton, just a white cotton. I don't think they're terribly different from the ones she had before. Elastic waist. And then to show the blue dress again, this is the lightweight cotton. This belt is the same material. It has two ribbons at the shoulder. The trims and decorations do go to the back, so that's nice. And it opens with Velcro as usual. So it's very pretty. But I really think the boots were the thing that sold me on this outfit. So I'm going to take Addie and her new clothes outside in some natural light and take some photos for you. And I really hope you've enjoyed this review. Thanks for watching.